Hello and welcome to the Outpost RV. My name is Jeremy, our cameraman is Henry, and today we're going to take a look at the Wolf Pup 17JG. This camper is about 23 and a half foot long and comes in just under 4,000 pounds. We'll get started on this side of the camper over here. You'll notice that we have your outside shower with hot and cold water. There is a coil hose sprayer that will come out. That is a low pressure spray port. Right here is your water connections. We have the city water, which is where if you're at your house or a campground, you simply hook up the water hose and that will pressurize the lines for you. Your fresh water connection. So if you're gonna be dry camping or boondocking, you can fill up the fresh water tank on the camper, turn the water pump on and use that water. We also have your six gallon DSI water heater, DSI standing for direct spark ignition. It is gas and electric. Your electric switch is actually in this bottom left hand corner here. The gas switch will be on the inside and you can get up to 10 gallons of hot water if you're running that gas or electric and up to 16 gallons if you're running gas and electric both together. We have the curved radius front end here with the diamond plate rock guard. We do have a group 27 deep cycle marine battery that comes with the camper. The juice pack option is on here so there is also a 50 watt solar panel mounted on the roof. We have your 20 pound LP tank bottle and that will be filled by the Outpost RV. We also have your quick lift system here in the front with the quick jack so you can crank it manually or flip this over and use your cordless screw gun to run this jack up and down. Also right there you'll notice they put this nice little holder on to keep your chains up off the ground and a place to store your seven weight cord as well. Right here we have your front storage compartment, lots of room underneath the bed area. We have your 25 foot detachable power cord and the manual hand, or the, the handle for the manual jacks as well. There are four jacks, two in the front and two in the back. And then we also have an LP quick disconnect. So if you have a portable gas grill, you can take that with you, plug it in there, use the gas on the camper instead of bringing an extra bottle. Nice 15 foot power awning with the blue LED accent lights underneath. Each leg is adjustable, so if the sun's coming down or there's a light ring, you can tip one side or both to adjust that as needed. There's 30 steps with the feet that are adjustable each leg, so if you're on different levels of ground. Oversized grab handle. We have the tempered glass black entrance door. It has an integrated window, which you can see better from the inside. And then also the full size screen door here. We do have the pup kitchen with the prep table and the mini fridge that comes with the camper. And we also have your outside entertainment center, your speakers which light up blue. The TV bracket is the same bracket on the inside, so you simply lift your TV up, bring it out here and slide it in. And then your TV connections and 110 outlet. Furnace vent right below. You'll notice we have the center cap popped off. It is a quick, easy lube axle. We do have the aluminum rims on here and it is a 15 inch tire. It comes with the um, tire pressure monitoring system. So the side is green and that will turn red if you're low on air. So I will unscrew this to demonstrate. So if that cap is red, you will need to put air in the tire. So you can do a nice walk around visual check before you leave for your next destination or head for home. We are pet friendly with the wolf pup here. So we have your leash latch so the furry family members can tag along. And back here we have like a garage storage area. So this is the bunk beds underneath the storage all the time. There's a black strap on the inside there so this bottom bunk can actually lift up and you get all of this storage. It's called a mini garage and you can put bicycles, coolers, all sorts of stuff in there. So a lot of great storage that you can use. The four inch tube bumper, this is where you're gonna store your sewer hose when you're traveling down the road. We have your spare tire with the cover that is mounted on the bumper. And up top in the middle, you'll notice that we have your backup camera already installed. So that is part of the uh, limited package that will come with the camper. Right over here, we have this nice bright light on the outside by your dump station so you can see what's going on. Down below is the dump station, gray handles for the gray tank, black handles for the black tank. And then last but not least, it is a 30 amp unit and it does come with a 25 foot detachable power cord. That concludes our outside walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 17JG. Now we'll head to the inside. As we head to the inside, you'll notice this slide out creates a lot of extra room in here. Uh, we can sleep a lot of people and it is really a well thought out camper and floor plan. We'll get started right inside the door here. We have your main control panel, which is where you can check your tanks, battery level, turn the lights on and off, run the slide room in and out 
as well as your awning up there. And that is on a motion sensor, so that way that will light up as you get close to it. In the kitchen area up top with the red numbers, we have your voltmeter, since we have the juice pack. Directly below that is your stereo. It is AM, FM, and Bluetooth compatible. Nice storage up top, microwave, and the range vent, which is vented to the outside. Lots of counter space here with the high-rise faucet, single bowl sink, which is a stainless steel, very large sink here. We have the two burner stove top that also has the cover, so you can use that as prep space if needed. Storage down below, and right on the left-hand side, that red key is your 12 volt cutoff switch. So if you are not using the camper, you can flip that switch and kill all power to the battery, so that way your battery does not drain on you. And we have your furnace right down below here. In the back, we have the bunk beds. Each bunk will have its own power source and light that they can turn on and off. Right there is the 12 volt charge port. And same down below, another 12 volt charge port and light. Before we head back to the bathroom, right here we have your thermostat that will run your furnace, the AC, uh, is controlled by the air conditioner itself right up top. We have the large 11 cubic refrigerator freezer combo. That is the 12 volt refrigerator, which is why we have the juice pack up top. And down below on the left hand side is your carbon monoxide detector. And on the right is gonna be where your breakers and your fuses are located. Now we will head back into the bathroom. We do have a vent fan up top on the ceiling. Down below we have your toilet and tub surround. They do put a sink in the corner of the bathroom here. So that has been a nice addition. And then of course up top we still have the handle up here for the shower itself. And now we'll come out and take a look in the main living room area. In the slide room, we have your large U-shaped dinette. We do have a 12 volt charge port, actually right over there in the corner. This will turn into another sleeping area. There is full length pullout drawers underneath each side. You'll see that with our pictures online and extra storage in that back bench as well. Just a little bit tougher to get to but it does offer a lot of storage up there. Up top on the ceiling, we have your AC. You'll notice the controls right on there. We also have two speakers inside and a subwoofer. And those have the blue LED accent lights as well. Up front with the queen bed, has a nice shelf right up above it with some 110 and 12 volt charge ports. Storage up above and windows at the head and feet of the bed as well. And then we have your TV connection right at the end of the bed, perfectly located so you can lay in bed and watch TV. Here's a shot of the window that is integrated in the door. So with that black glass door, you can't see inside of it, um, but you do have a window here that you can see outside with. And that'll conclude the walkthrough of our Wolf Pup 17JG. Feel free to contact myself or Henry with any questions at 866-338-9845. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.